Hey everybody, this is Mike Strange. You're watching Half Fast Racing, but today we're not racing. We are unboxing. Uh, I have been on the hunt for a direct drive wheel for a while. Doing all the homework, all the research, reading all the forums, watching all of the online drivers and uh, sim racers, going into their uh, you know descriptions to see what they got. And uh, I was just this close to buying a Fanatec. I gotta tell you, I really was, and I'm not knocking their product at all. But I've had a Logitech, what is it, G27 or 25 for years. I mean, we were arguing it's been almost a decade, we think, that I've had that system, played Gran Turismo on it. The kids have played with it. It has taken a beating. It still works. Uh, those who watch the channel, you know, I did have a little bit of a sticky pedal for a while, but that issue's been resolved. So, um, you know, heck of a good wheel and pedal set. Uh, so, recently saw the Logitech Pro. Uh, has come out and didn't hesitate had to have it So what we're doing today is unboxing. I have the Logitech Pro wheel and pedals uh, And I'm pointing at boxes as if I know which ones in which and I do don't. you want to pull one box off the table yeah, We will set one box down on this lovely uh, floor My bench over is here. over there. Yep, or the bench that is over here in, in my in my path kind of here We'll set this big one down and we'll start with the little one. How about that? Oof. All right, let's see what we got first here. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, it's like Christmas morning. Ooh, and we have petals. Look at there, look at that pretty box. Very reminiscent of the box the last set came in, if I remember correctly. Same color scheme almost. Okay. All right. Let's. Uh, Do you need help to get safety third? Box. We'll put the box knife away for a minute, and we're. Oh, uh, it's got a good vacuum seal leak. Five. Uh, just, just about. Oh, small Let's move that back out. Wow. Yeah. All right, take a look all around, get a good shot of her. Definitely a uh, pretty packaging they send them in. Has all the features over there. Right. I'll get to read them later. No, I am joking, I'm gonna turn it around. 100 kilogram load cell break. I'm gonna be strong. Okay, maybe a slightly different angle was intended. Or a slide out, maybe. Let's take out the piece of paper that, okay. Well, the first thing you find is a piece of paper that my wife, who put her glasses on to use the GoPro, would have to oh my explain Lord. to you. Uh, we're not going to try to use it. It is apparently not meant to be read by humans. I, and they're moving around too much for me to. Yeah, it's, it's only, it's legal. It's gotta be legal stuff. You know, it's kind of like the, at the end of the video, we're going to say 700 miles an hour because we don't want actually to hear it, but the lawyers made us say it and they wanted to know it was here. You know, it's kind of like that thing. Grease for pedals. Grease? There's grease for pedals. Wow. That's fancy. All right. And well. they don't want you to let kids have it. Okay. Yeah, it's 11 newton meters. We're probably going to have to uh, figure out a power turn now. So we're going to turn it around. You can see everybody see. I'm just going to take one of these two boxes out. Let's see what's in this bed boy here. All right, Why Logitech does this keep... G Challenge put you and your gear to the test to win prizes. So there's a Logitech G Challenge, something to do with McLaren. A cable. Ooh. G sticker. I think we might have a home for that somewhere. It might be a little white car who gets a Logitech G, st G sticker. Maybe then they'll show up and give me some free stuff I don't own. I don't know what that would be at this point. Dear Logitech, if you make chassis, Half Fast Racing is happy to have sponsors. Uh, Sim seats, hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You know what I mean? 
Uh, looks like some instructions for wiring and installation here. With no text, so we'll have to figure it out from the pictures. Goes around to the back. Because it's written for boys. Oh, that's great. We'll figure that out. Look, we'll use that. That'll make sense at some point to us. It will become crystal clear. All right. Let's see. The cable. Is a cable. Yeah, USB on one side. Looks like an older USB. Get to see. the good stuff. God, you gotta, you gotta be patient. We, cables are cables. All right, let's see here. That all, that all folds flat. Let's pull this out. See what else is in the hole this was in. More stuff to fold flat. Wow, while it all looks pretty, it smells horrible. So don't put the close to your nose while you're unboxing your Logitech G equipment. Oh, this is where the instructions for the brake grease come in. I got spring choices. The spring choices for pedals. Okay. Looks like some different uh, bushings. Yeah, there's a really hard bushing, much softer bushing, even softer but shorter bushing, perhaps for a little different feel. I will bet somewhere on their site they sell additional springs and bushings we can fill these wonderful spots with and an Allen wrench. Hmm. It's almost like setting up uh, pedal sets for cars here. Because I know you all need another Allen wrench. Oh. Who has enough Allen wrenches? Never. There aren't enough Allen wrenches in the world. They just don't exist. So it's a miracle that we ever find one that's the right size. That fits right. It's always the same one. No, the problem is it's never the same one. That's why they have to send you the set. They're like, no, we had to use our special, special side. It's 11.2 millimeters. Because that was the size our engineer said we had to do it in. And nobody in the meeting thought to push back and go, hey, you know, 12, 12 standard. Let's just do 12. So I will say first, it certainly feels impressive. Okay, so that base is a, uh, a plastic, but starting right like that feels maybe. And from the weight, it doesn't feel plastic. It is very dense, very sturdy. Lots of uh, adjustments down here in terms of pedal adjustments. So we can move the pedals back and forth and uh, and go out and measure the Miata pedals and put them exactly where the Miata pedals would be. Ooh, and some stiff pedals too. Feel that break? Come on, camera, you can get your hand in the shot. Go ahead, let them see. Ooh, tell me I need a stiff break. Hmm. It looks like it twists. I'm going to read before I twisty twisty on any of the parts. But, oh, wow. Definitely high pedal. High quality pedals, arms feel pretty nice. Uh, looks like if you look at the back of the pedals here, you get you a good shot of that side too. We'll take off this pro. Ooh, no, that's not a. That's just a little piece of plastic. That 